Hi everyone, today we are going to be talking about all of the Amazon purchases that I've made that are absolutely fantastic since my last Amazon video, which was really favourably received, so I thought it was about time we did another one. If you are after 100% beauty content, this probably isn't going to be for you. There are a few beauty items in the mix, but there's also lifestyle and also organisation and a couple of other things within this video as well. I hope you'll stick around till the end. If you decide it's not for you, beauty content will definitely resume in the next video. So I'm not going to be talking about every single purchase that I've made from Amazon because we will be here all week and a lot of the purchases that I've made recently have been dog related so you probably won't be interested in them unless you have a dog. We have recently been blessed in our family with a new addition in the form of 14 week old puppy Ralph who has just captured my absolute soul. He is just beautiful. It's not gone without its hiccups. Only me can decide to have the builders in at the same time as getting a brand new puppy. I do like to challenge myself, but I wouldn't have it any other way. So a lot of the purchases that I've made recently with toys to help him not chew every single piece of furniture that I have in my house, you probably won't be interested in. So I'm going to leave all those things out and just put all the good stuff in. So let's get on with it. Jumping into the first item, I didn't actually buy this product from Amazon. I bought it from Look Fantastic with my Look Fantastic discount code and got it for a really decent price. But in hindsight, if I'd have bought it from Amazon for just a fraction more than I paid on Look Fantastic, I could have got more attachments with this. So I would have got more for my money and I'm kicking myself slightly for not doing it that way, which is why I've put it in this video. This is from T3 and it is their curling one. And the one that I suggest that you get is the T3 World Trio curling tongs. You get three attachments with that particular one, whereas this one only comes with one. And I would have really liked to try the other attachments. It's just, yeah. Hindsight is a funny thing, isn't it? Now, this is great for anybody with Beatrice's length hair, which is around about here, just below shoulder length, but it's also really good for my length hair. I had a few layers cutting my hair the last time that I went. I never thought that I looked good with a curl. Turns out it was just because I was used to seeing my hair straight and not curly and I didn't have the right tools to give me that subtle curl. I didn't want anything poodleish, nothing corkscrewy. I just wanted a really subtle, soft wave and this gives me that. So it is quite unusual with the cone being inverted. So the smaller point is at the end and the larger point is at the top, which gives you that really nice volume at the root and the nice curl at the bottom. And my hair doesn't hold a curl. So having a tighter curl at the end of my hair, which is the first bit to drop, is really, really useful for me because it just holds that curl for a little bit longer. This is so super easy to use, even for me that is extremely clumsy. The cord comes with its own Velcro fastening. So if you are a neat freak like me, that will make you extremely happy because every time you use it, you're not going to get tangled up in the wire when you're putting it away. It just fastens up really nicely so you can store it away much more neatly than if this wasn't on here. You also get a heat protective glove, which has been an absolute lifesaver for me. Usually when I curl my hair, if I'm not wearing one of these, I just get burn marks all over the place. I am not ambidextrous, which means holding my hair in one hand and curling it with the other <laughs> is a challenge and uh, pig trotter fingers and all that being extremely clumsy, this really does save me from a lot of discomfort. So you get all of that in the pack. And if you buy it from Amazon and you choose the trio, you get another two attachments as well. So bonus. Stephanie Marie actually enticed me to buy this. She was FaceTiming me one day and was curling her hair at the same time. And I was just intrigued by the cone on this and the fact that Stephanie's hair always looks absolutely beautiful. I thought I would give it a go and I am not sad that I did. 
Moving on, this next product has been a game changer for me. So I spend my life, a lot of it anyway, outdoors. So I'm either stood next to a football pitch watching Beatrice play football on a Saturday, stood next to a football pitch watching Seth play football on a Sunday, or I'm at a football match watching Sheffield United play. It's very cold at the moment. It's also very cold at home because we don't have a roof. <laughs> hmm a little bit chilly, so I wanted something that was going to keep me warm and also look nice because the two don't often correlate. I found these leggings on Amazon. I tried some of the Furline leggings from Amazon and really didn't like them, didn't get on with them at all, passed them on to B. she absolutely loves them. I just found that I couldn't find my size in them and also the fur lining meant that they didn't have very much give in them, so they were slightly uncomfortable for me to wear and pulled in the wrong places. These, stunning. These are fleece lined leggings. They are super warm and they also don't make you look slightly wider because you would not know that these were fleece lined. They are the same thickness that they would have been had they not been fleece lined. They feel heavy, they feel comfortable, they feel smooth, they slightly suck you in a little bit as well, which is always a positive for me anyway. These are supposed to be workout leggings. I don't wear them for workout leggings because, I mean, I would melt. <laughs> but they are really comfortable and really useful if you spend a lot of time in the cold and you want to keep warm. I do not like being cold at all. And these have saved me on more than one occasion. So because these are designed to look like workout leggings, you also get all of the pockets that you would get in workout leggings. So you get a little pocket for your keys, you get pockets for your phone as well, but it also has that sort of workout wide stitching on all of the seams. So they do look like workout leggings, they don't look like normal leggings. Having said that, I have worn these with floaty jumpers and they have been absolutely beautiful. I, I just don't care, I'm warm. They also sell these in a khaki green colour and I believe a burgundy as well. I am eager to get my hands on the khaki shade, although I know that won't go with as many things in my wardrobe, I still want them. <laughs> and I am also going to be buying another black pair because like I said before, extremely clumsy, tend to spill things down myself all the time. And if it's not wash day and I want to wear them the day after, always good having another pair in the drawer really like them. Let's talk about a product that is completely different and this is one that I want to shout from the rooftops about because it has been so useful to me and I know it will be useful for a lot of other women as well who are going through a very similar thing. Highly recommend you get your hands on this if you possibly can and it is on offer on Amazon so definitely worth checking this out. If you saw my skincare favourites of 2022, you will have heard me discuss some issues with my health that I was dealing with during 2022 and I'm still dealing with now but I'm sort of coming out the other side of it now or at least I can see the light at the end of the tunnel. Maybe a long journey but I can see it and it is a positive light. So this book really helped me within that journey. It's from Davina McCall. Now if you're not from the UK you probably won't know who Davina is. She is a TV personality in the UK and and she is just amazing. She is an inspiration. She decided that she was going to talk about her perimenopause and menopause journey and put it all in a book. This book was also written by Dr. Naomi Potter, who is an expert within that field. So there is so much amazing information within this book. Things that I never thought were symptoms of perimenopause really shocked me. I cried through a lot of this book, I'm not gonna lie. I was so comforted by the fact that I wasn't alone. Even though I wasn't speaking directly to Davina, I felt listened to and heard. This also has the stories of so many other women and what they've been through, which directly correlated with my story, going to the doctors, being told I was way too young to be in perimenopause, to go away, some doctors wanting to put 
put me on antidepressants. It was just a vicious circle. So knowing that some other ladies were going through the same thing and who had the same experiences and were having very similar symptoms to me, the whole brain fog thing, the emotions, feeling like you're walking on a tightrope constantly, making sure that you keep hold of your emotions or don't internally combust and take it out on everybody around you. This is just amazing and if you are thinking you are going through something similar, I highly recommend you get your hands on this book. I am a great believer in talking about things, being able to share your experiences, not being embarrassed. We all have bodies, they all function pretty similarly and we're all going to be going through this at some point if you've not gone through it already. So I just think this is a wealth of knowledge and not only that, it just makes you feel like you're not going completely nuts. That's what this did for me. Definitely recommend it. And it's on offer, so. This is the next product that I want to talk about. Not the Apple Watch, but the watch strap. I love this strap. I ordered it just after Christmas and it has not been off my wrist since. It's more of a champagne gold rather than a yellow gold or a rose gold. So it will go with both yellow gold and rose gold. I have a rose gold Apple Watch and it goes perfectly with that. It's magnetic. It's extremely easy to put on with one hand because again, very clumsy, so I struggle one-handed, especially as I choose to wear my watch on my right hand, which I am actually right-handed, so I know that's unusual. Does anybody else do that? Because everybody in the UK calls me very strange for having my watch on my right arm when I am right-handed. Everybody says that you should have it on your left arm. Your less dominant arm should have your watch. I completely disagree. This is how I like it. This is what I'm gonna do. But anyway, do let me know in the comments section if you are strange like me. I love this and it is a fraction of the cost of a usual Apple strap that you would get directly from Apple. I can probably get two, maybe even three of these for the price of a watch strap from Apple. And I would much rather do that and be able to switch out my straps to match an outfit than just be stuck with one strap. So let me just show you the fastening and how secure this is. So there's one magnet here, which is incredibly strong. As you can see, it really doesn't want to go anywhere. And then there's another magnet of equal strength on the bottom as well. So you just need to loosen that off, take your arm out, put it on charge, pop your arm back in again, put it up to the desired fit, and then you're good to go. So secure and looks beautiful. I am really impressed. These next couple of items are in the organisation category. You know how I like to be organised. I have a lot of skincare. I not only have my normal skincare routine skincare, but I also have other products that I'm switching out on a daily basis just to try them out for everybody to give my opinion on them all. So there's a lot. There is a lot by the side of my bed. There was so much that I decided to get a box and put all of my skincare within the box, just so that it didn't spill out over the rest of my side because it was taking over. And then, the box started getting over full and started spilling out onto the rest of the side anyway. Plus it was all mishmashed in the box and I could never find anything that I wanted. It used to take me forever. So I saw this on Amazon and it has completely revolutionized my storage of my skincare and it looks beautiful as well. So this is the storage system and I can see everything I have aside for my daytime skincare routine, I have aside for my treatments, I have aside for my evening skincare routine and I also have a hair care side as well. This gets me so excited because it has everything that I had in the box that looked so untidy, unorganized and just a mess and I can see everything and it is just it's beautiful and it spins and it's so easy to access. It's just marvellous and it wasn't overly expensive either. It was a little bit difficult to put together though. It's not supposed to be difficult to put together but I made the mistake of putting this together in front of my dad and making a complete fool of myself. He came over and went, I think that's upside down. <laughs> 
<laughs> you ought to see me with a piece of Ikea furniture. It is not a pretty sight. Moving on to the next organisational little gem. And I am really quite smug talking about this because honestly, this room used to be a disaster area. My sister-in-law walked in here before Christmas, looked at the chaos and just said... I have no idea how you concentrate in that room. It is just so disorganised. There are bits everywhere. And yeah, she was actually quite concerned. She sternly said, you need to sort this room out. Otherwise, you will not be productive. And she was right, completely right. And now I've sorted it, I'm like, well done me. These next products really helped. I obviously have a lot of wires in this room with my camera, lighting, other electrical pieces of equipment, and it was just like Spaghetti Junction. I have tidied them all up with these. These are genius. Not little ties that you used to fasten your sandwich bags up with that used to cut your fingers and were really difficult to release. <laughs> Oh no, no, these have magnets and they're really strong magnets. So you can get hold of your wire, wrap them together, wrap this all the way around and just fasten it together with the magnets and they're going nowhere. They come in lots of different colors. I got a pack, how many were in my pack? 12, six colors. 12 within the pack and um, I actually had to buy another 12 because I ran out. It was it was not good in here and now it is. So definitely recommend these. We also have some of these downstairs now because with us all living in one space at the moment, we don't have individual spaces for ourselves because of the build. We're all crammed into one space. So within our games room, Seth has his setup with his gaming chair, and his little TV. Then Wes has his TV, which was the normal TV that was in the games room all along. And he plays Xbox on that. And then B likes to watch TV. So she has her TV in the others. It's an, it's an absolute nightmare. Just <sighs> completely an utter nightmare. So if you are really wanting organization and you are a stickler for not having wires on show, these will really help you out. They have definitely helped me. Did I mention we got a puppy? This next product has been in use a lot recently with all of the toilet accidents that we've had within the Pampered Wolf household, which has been incredibly frustrating, but it's just one of those things that's going to happen. I didn't actually know we were going to be getting a puppy when I ordered this item. This was a Christmas present to myself. I know it's really sad, but it was the most excited I had been about a Christmas present for a really, really long time. Maybe that's because Wes gets really naff Christmas presents for me. No, it's not. I just, I'm a bit sad like that and I get really excited about things that are relatively mundane. This is a mop. I know, a mop. Hmm, I'm now rethinking my life choices just a little bit, but I am really excited about this because it pretty much does everything. Now, I have wooden floors. I have laminate wooden floors. They're not real wood, but it's really high gloss. And because of all the building works and now the puppy, those floors, they don't stay clean for very long. So I decided to get this mop. This is one of those mops that does it all. I mean, it doesn't mop your floor for you, but... You fill it full of water, you can then dry it off a little bit so it's not completely soaked when you put it on your floor, which when you've got floors like mine, you can't have a lot of water on the floor, otherwise all my floor will just expand and all start coming up. So it's semi-wet, a little bit damp, not soaking wet. Then you can clean your floor and when all the mop is dirty, put it back, spin it, like it's in a washing machine, completely get it clean and then once again dry it all off again and go on your way. I, I just love it. This is one of those miracle products that just makes me smile every time I look at it, which is a good job because I am using it a lot. A lot. And finally, this is one of those little gadgets that I think everybody should have. If you have a mobile phone or an iPad that needs charging and every time you need it charging, you can never find a charger or somebody's nicked the charge cable because theirs is broken. This is from Anchor and it is their charging pad. This is quite honestly such a good little gadget 
This lives on my kitchen side now. It will not work if you have one of these on the back of your phone. It needs direct contact, but it will work through a case, which some of the other ones that I had a look at wouldn't do. You had to take the case off, and who wants to be doing that every time they charge the phone? Definitely not me. I only bought one of these, and that was where I completely and utterly failed as a parent and as a wife apparently. So Wes uses this all the time and I moved it upstairs because I knew I was filming this video today and he came home yesterday and went, where's the charger? <laughs> anyway, my kids want one in their bedrooms and Wes wants one for his desk at work because they are so, so useful. This doesn't come with the anchor charging plug that is meant to be used with this device. You have to buy that one separately. Being completely honest, I haven't bought that. I just plug the USB port into my normal iPad charger or my normal Apple phone charger and it works perfectly well. I do have a feeling though that if you were to buy the proper anchor charging plug that would probably charge your devices a little bit faster than this one because it is quite a slow charge. It's not a rapid charge but I wouldn't be without this now. Actually that is a lie. I probably could live without this, but I don't think my kids or Wes would be able to, so that's my two penneth on this one anyway. So that's it for this video. I really hope you've enjoyed it. I know it was different to my usual content. We are back to normal within the next video. Let me know what you've thought about this. Have you found it interesting? Have you found it useful at all? Let me know about your Amazon purchases in the comment section because I'm eager to know what you've all been buying as well. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and hope to see you all in the next video. Bye everyone.